so the law is Title IX, but I think the value is gender equity, right? And so that's what we talk about, gender equity and wanting to provide an equitable experience to all of our student athletes. This is Jess Neely from this end down here. So that's Magoogan. That's New Magoogan. I think it's clear that um, since the advent of Title IX, there have been more and more opportunities for young women. And so I do think that you can show that there's real progress that's been made. That the commitment to gender equity, though we don't think about Title IX as something to comply with, again, it's part of a core value to provide equitable opportunities. I would hope that's part of our DNA and that it is seen in how we make decisions on a day-to-day -day basis. Title IX was designed to create access, and Title IX understood the importance of representation. So the law is there. Now it's up to people like me and other folks who are influencers and decision makers to make sure that we're taking steps to actually make the law do what it was designed to do. Uh, we should be proud that we're celebrating the 50th anniversary and certainly all the progress that has come with it, but I would hope that in the next 50 years, um, this commitment to gender equity is really baked into who we are and what we do every day so that maybe we don't have to <laughs> talk so much about the importance of that law. Instead, it just becomes a part of who we are.